I took his demo and got him signed. Fat Joe, cool. Trick Daddy, I took his shit and got him signed. Hmm. Okay, Fuji. Fuji, that was supposed to be mine. I ain't put the Fujis on, but I'm telling you about facts. <laughs> Luke is a living legend, an icon, uh, somebody we look up to, somebody we love forever. We preserve the culture. Yes, he went to the Supreme Court. Yes, he did. Luke is a living legend. There's no way an icon, living, living, living legend. And yes, he put on the whole Miami. But Fat Joe, don't lie. And Fat Joe, don't back down for nothing in the universe. I hope we all know this in love. Now, uh, I said what I said. Okay, so I didn't put on Trick Daddy. What I did do was I came to Miami. His music was rocking all over the Calmart, all over the streets. I came to Super Bowl and I took, I had no business, nothing to do with discovering Trick Daddy. I took his CD, his demo. Maybe Trick Daddy don't know this. But when I heard his demo, I took it to Atlantic Records that Monday and I went to Craig Kalman's office. Craig Kalman is whoever he is. I haven't talked to him in 15 years. He's like the CEO. He's the boss of all bosses up there. I took him this demo and had a love for hip hop and the culture. I said, you need to sign this guy. This guy's the next big thing. Fat Joe had nothing to do with paperwork. Fat Joe didn't put him on like none of that. I don't even know if Trick Daddy knows it. I did it out of love for hip hop because the man was on fire. And guess what? Craig Common called me and said, you know the tape you brought me? Yeah, we signed him with Slip and Slide Records. So don't know if Trick Daddy know it. Don't know if Slick and Slide. But I, I've been saying it for years. Pitbull. I have a friend named Robbie Rob Fernandez. I, I don't want this to get ugly, guys. Robbie Rob was there for me. When I was nobody, okay? Robbie Roberts from here in Miami. Let me stay in this house when I was on the run in New York City. I never forgot it. When I got popping in music, Robbie Rob came to me because I had pun double platinum. I was platinum and said, this is my artist. Can you help me? I went to TVT that was chasing me for a million decades to do business with them. Brian Leach was there. And I took his demo to TBT and told him he's the next star. They signed him. I don't have no business with Pitbull. Once again, I did it for love. Add a culture. That's it. I'm not trying to take credit away from Luke or from the history of my end. The truth is the truth. That's what I'm saying. Now, Luke, he put a lot of people on, I guess. I mean, I don't want to go. Look, let's keep it all peace. You know what I'm saying? Because the man is a living legend or whatever. But when I say something... I mean it, guys. Ooh, that's a good